What's going on? Taco Stacks here, back with another vlog. Today we're going to the thrift store. Probably going to go to a couple thrift stores. I'm going to be doing a couple thrift store vlogs coming up. Um, think about maybe three to four videos a week between scrapping, picking, thrift stores, auctions, flea markets, whatever it might be. So thrift store vlogs, if you're interested in scrap vlogs or whatever it might be, um, just stay tuned for these. More videos will be coming out. We're going to a thrift store today. Uh, as some of you might know, I do sell pre-owned clothes for a living. So this is where I kind of source. So we're going to see what we can come across. Hopefully come across a couple of good items. Some big ticket items. Maybe not. Maybe so. Might just be a huge lot of inventory. It did snow a lot yesterday. As I said in a previous vlog, 8 to 12 inches predicted. Probably 13 to 15. I think we got around 20. So, so yeah. We're going to go out there. Hopefully the roads are alright. I was trying to go to two or three thrift stores today. Might just be able to do one. Uh, might be able to do a small one, uh, as well as just the big one that I go to. Try to get some footage of that. Uh, we might even hit one of those Goodwill outlet stores, which are always cool. Um, because they're simply just all the inventory that never sold, regardless of the reason why. Yeah, so let's get at it. As you can see, I got a couple eBay orders overnight. I guess because of the weather, a lot of people stood at home, decided to buy stuff. So it was definitely a good day because of the weather. Um, so yeah, we're going to pack these up put them in a bag and we'll be on our way. So we're here, uh, Family Thrift, Salvation Army, usually on Wednesdays they do half off. Uh, everything is like 50% off, and except for the things that they put out that week, and only for clothing and shoes and books, but I don't really buy any shoes or books. So it usually is a crowded day here um, with the snow. I, you know, time can tell. I don't know how much more inventory they put out yesterday. Since I do come here pretty much every week, it's kind of like they need every day to put out new inventory just so that you know, I can get new merchandise. So given the snowstorm yesterday, I don't know if they were open. Um, I do see people inside working right now, so there should be some new inventory. It, it looks like they kind of did a little bit of a different layout as well as I'm looking in right now. The travel here was, you know, it was fine once I got off the back roads, like the highways were fine, but there, there was just snow everywhere. It, this is going to probably take about three to four weeks to melt, um, in my, my assumption. So we'll see what we can find. Hopefully you can find something good, maybe a couple couple sports jerseys and whatnot just a little update uh usually at 857 which it is right now there's about a line past that blue car over there the blue suv of people from the front door to there and today there's not one person out there uh, and usually this parking parking lot's full yeah a car coming in right now but i mean this is going to this could be a good day this could be a really bad day i don't think there's going to be a lot of competition we'll, you know we'll see what we can come across At least it's warm. Oh, yes. Warm.
So try to buy things that are seasonal. Uh, right now, Final Four coming up, so. I mean, that will sell pretty quick. I mean, if you're doing this for extra money, always try to buy something that's seasonal. It, it does sell, it sells quick, so. sold furniture I would buy that it's not a great piece but it's vintage it's it's popular right now so out of gas so I'm going to fill up a little bit if you think I'm going to stand out there for a full tank you are nuts it is so cold I've already stepped in snow my, my feet are soaked it just it's a mess
pretty pricey. So I have to pass on that one. That's all brass. I don't know how much I weigh. It probably weighs two pounds. So about three bucks in scrap. But if that was 99 cents or something, I'd probably buy that. but they're half off so they're only four bucks. She needs a bath, that's for sure. She definitely needs a bath. Now we're going to the Goodwill outlet store. Hey, we're here. There wasn't a lot of competition today, so you know I only came across one guy who was with a pile of all the stuff that I would buy, you know, vintage clothes. Um, but yeah, you know, you, you just you just got to go out there and you know accomplish what you want to accomplish for the day. And, you know, the rest will fall into your hands.